Hey there. Thought you guys might be interested in seeing my new little workshop setup. I got a. Uh, somebody might remember my old purple sandwich. Pretty decent size. Down to about 240 pounds, I think it is now. With uh, not counting the base. I had to cut it. Um, I can't bury it in the ground of my garage, so. We got some uh, Mr. Oil here. It's got used motor oil, peanut oil, all kinds of stuff in it. Um, Brian, for quenching. My wife really loved uh, dragonflies and it kind of rubbed off on me for good luck. Haven't cracked one yet, so. Pink can forage. I set it up with two burners this time and a hole for a third. Um, I'd like to weld in it. I think that's what the gold was, so. It gets hot, way hotter than the last one, and with that extra, extra kick from the extra flip the torch that you'll see, it burns super even and super, super hot. Um, just some barbecue tanks. This is important right there. Um, straightening angle, stereo, messy workbench, tool boxes, and that's pretty much it. I mean, this is a nine by nine area right here from the forge and the tool boxes up to the door. And uh, on all honesty, it's all you need. You don't, you don't need a whole lot. So, there you have it. Next you'll see me uh, heat treat the little knife that I made. So, I love W2's good stuff. Alright guys, um, we're going to heat treat some Aldo's W2 today. I'm, uh, I don't know if you can see that, the light in here, it's kind of dim. Um, just a little uh, clip point knife I set up. I got some pictures of it that we saw at the beginning of the video. Um, I'll be quenching from 120 degree Fahrenheit flying into 250 degree Mr. Oil. It's got all kinds of crap in it. Uh, so, all the luck.
Well, let's see what we got here. We have a file. Sounds great. Oh, I'm going to get this into the uh, oven. And thanks for watching.